Good morning, walking warriors. And how are you doing today? I hope this finds you guys doing okay. I hope you had a good evening. Well rested. Got out there and did some walking this morning. It's already about 9.15 and I'm just now getting up and going. I want to touch base with you about journaling. Um, somebody said to me, why don't you turn this into a video journal? Well, I could definitely do that. But there's a lot of private things that go into a video journal. And some of those things I'm just not ready to put out there for the whole entire world to see. Like relationships and different things like that. Um, intimate and personal details with my husband and my children. This is very public forum, and though I said I my life is an open book to you, that is true. But <clears throat> there are certain things that I would like to hold near and dear to my heart for a while. <clears throat> so today we're going to talk about different relationships. Let's talk about relationships with parents first and foremost. I have a personally wonderful relationship with my mom. We have had it rough in teenage years, as I'm sure most of you have. And um, you kind of tend to have a love-hate relationship with your children during the teenage years, you love to hate each other, which is true for the most part. I gave my mom hell when I was a teenager, and I'm finding that I'm going through that same experience with my own children as they grow into teenage years. But for the most part, my mom and I have an excellent relationship right now. We talk every single day except for Saturdays and Sundays. And we, <clears throat> I just went to go visit her a couple weeks ago. And every time I visit, we do thrift shopping and we go out to lunch. This time, though, we didn't go out to lunch, but we did do thrift store shopping. One of the favorite things that we love to do is go out to lunch at our favorite Chinese restaurant there in Yakima, which is called the Great Shanghai. And then we go out thrift store shopping. Well, we didn't go do the lunch aspect this time, but we did do the thrift store shopping. And I did get a lot of cute clothes. My relationship with my biological father is <clears throat> like a father-friendly daughter kind of relationship. Um, I would love to say it's the perfect father-daughter relationship, but honestly, there's a lot of kind of issues that go along in that relationship. And if he's watching, I'm sorry for it being that way. But you understand why, hopefully. The relationship I had with my two stepdads before they passed away was a great relationship. I would talk to my stepdad, Bill, on a daily basis. <clears throat> and we had a great relationship. My relationship with my children 
my relationship with my oldest son is kind of strained. And I hate that. I hate that it's strained, but it is what it is. My relationship with my 19 year old is fairly good. <clears throat> Sorry, I have allergies and I get this post nasal drip going on. So it causes a lot of mucus going on in the back of my throat. Not to be like too gross or anything. So. Like I said, my relationship with my 19-year-old is really good. My relationship with my 16-year-old child, she, they are 16. Therefore, we've got the whole love-hate relationship going on. And my relationship with my 12-year-old is kind of hectic. He is... 12 years old, he's kind of difficult to handle a lot of the times. My relationship with my husband is really good. <clears throat> In fact, I'm hoping, apparently we're supposed to be getting the stipend. I guess from the government for this COVID stipend so if we get this stipend I'm hoping that my husband and I can go on this date tonight to the theaters take our 10 or our 12 year old son with us go see Black Widow or Cruella I personally would like to go see the um oh what's that movie called the assassin's wife's bodyguard or something like that <clears throat> my relationship with my family overall I don't have a very good relationship with my maternal side of my family and as far as my paternal side of my family I don't really have a relationship with them either my paternal side is mainly because they don't know me they don't know much about me at all they just know that they have a niece from their brother having a previous marriage and they know about that but as far as anything else they don't know me and as far as my maternal side of my family they're just I don't know it's just a really rocky relationship they don't like me because I was seen as my grandfather's favorite, I guess. Though I do have a cousin that is my favorite cousin and we do hang out when we can. We do talk a lot. Um, I love her to death. Hi, Stacy. Shouts out to you. So, um, I think I'm going to cut this video short today because I honestly, I don't know what to talk about. 
or maybe I'll come up with a different video idea and I'll start a new video. Oh, I did want to say, disclaimer, do not start an uh, exercise program without the approval of your doctor or talking to your doctor first. This can be dangerous and unless your doctor knows that you're going to start an exercise program, he may advise against it. So I don't want you guys to be like, yeah, I'm going to go walk and I'm going to lose all this weight and have underlying medical conditions and have something happen. So do not go out and do any kind of exercise programs without the approval of your doctor. You really need to have the approval of your doctor first. Also, any of my videos are not made for children. I'll probably throw an F-bomb out there. And I would really hate for your children to overhear that. Plus some videos might have some sexual content in them. And I highly doubt your children want to hear about sex in a video. So my videos were made for mature audiences only. And see what else. I'm sorry if my videos cause seasickness or motion sickness. I try my best to make sure that I'm not shaking, but I do what I can and sometimes it doesn't help like right now. Um... Let's see, can they think of anything else? I can't think of anything else. But yeah, please keep that disclaimer into the top of your mind frame. Do not start a medical exercise program without discussing this with your doctor first. And I will hopefully see you soon and have a great day, my warrior walkers, and I will talk to you later, okay? Have a safe day, have a good day, and peace out.